Lesson 8.8, .8, Choose a Measuring Tool. Some measuring tools can be folded. That makes them easier to put away. And some measuring tools will measure a very long distance along the ground as you walk. Steel tape measures can be up to 100 feet long. And they're used by carpenters and builders to measure very long objects. We can choose the correct measuring tool when measuring lengths. So in this lesson, we're going to learn about the ruler, the yardstick, and the measuring tape. The ruler is for short and straight objects. Yardstick, that's for straight and long objects. And a measuring tape is for objects that are not flat or straight. They're good for measuring things with curves. A 12-inch ruler is one foot long. They are useful for measuring straight objects less than one foot long, such as pencils, crayons, finger length, a piece of paper, scissors, and books. A yardstick is 36 inches long. 36 inches is equal to three rulers. That's equal to three feet. And they're useful for measuring straight objects longer than a foot such as a desk or table, a floor, a chair's height. We know a ruler is 12 inches. If we add 12 plus 12 plus 12, three rulers, it's equal to 36 inches. That's one yardstick. A measuring tape is 60 inches long. 60 inches is equal to five rulers. That's equal to five feet. And they're useful for measuring curved, bent or difficult places like a waistline or cloth when sewing or inside of a drawer. You might see tailors using these to make measures. Tala and Bob each have a pumpkin. They want to compare the distances around their pumpkins. Which measuring tool should they use? Circle the best tool they can use. Should they use a ruler? Should they use a yardstick or should they use a measuring tape? Do you remember which one is good for curved objects? If you said measuring tape, you're right. Measuring tapes are good for measuring objects that are not flat or straight. Bob wants to know the height of his refrigerator. Circle the best tool he can use. Should he use a ruler, a yardstick, or a measuring tape? Now remember, it says the best tool he can use. If you said yardstick, you're right. To measure the height of this refrigerator, a yardstick would be the best tool. If he uses a yardstick, he might have to make two measures, maybe to here and then up here. If he uses the ruler, because it's only 12 inches, he'll have to make a measure, a measure, a measure, a measure, a measure. That's a lot more measures. So this best tool would be a yardstick. He would only make a couple measures. Dave wants to measure the length of his toothbrush. Circle the best measuring tool he can use. Would the best tool be a ruler, a yardstick, or a measuring tape? If you said ruler, you're right. That's 12 inches, and a toothbrush is not that long. So we can use rulers, yardsticks, and measuring tapes to measure objects. It will be easier to measure 